Hi, this is Michael at TV Radio 1972, and I found out about another feature of a radio that I just reviewed, the GWiz ZWS604. It is the weather alert feature. So, here's how I'm able to get it. I'm going to unmute the audio, but what I'm going to do is long press the WB button, the weather band button. New Jersey, Hunterdon, Morris, Somerset, Sussex, and Warwick. And it searches through all seven of the channels. And then when there's an alert, it'll turn on whatever frequency the weather alert is there. Such as require weekly tests or warnings or watches. So what I'm going to do is show you the results of this feature that I did during the required weekly test, which is usually on Wednesdays. In my area, it's after 11 a.m. in the morning, Eastern Standard Time, or 1600 UTC for those of you overseas. So, I'll show you the results. Weather Service Office at Brookhaven National Laboratory in Upton, New York. The preceding signal was a test of the NOAA All Hazards Radio Public Warning System on Station 435 from New York City. During potentially dangerous weather situations, specially built receivers can be automatically activated by the signal to warn of the impending hazard. Tests of the signal and receiver performance are normally conducted by the National Weather Service at 11 a.m. each Wednesday. If there is a threat of severe weather, the test will be postponed to the next available good weather day. Reception of this broadcast, and especially the warning alarm, will vary at any given location. This variability, normally more noticeable at greater distances from the transmitter, can sometimes occur even though you are using a good quality receiver in good working order. To provide the most consistent and dependable warning service possible, the warning alarm will be activated for hazardous watches and warnings for the following counties in southeast New York, Bronx, Kings, Nassau, New York, Orange, Pittman, Queens, Richmond, Rockland, Suffolk, and Westchester, in northern and central New Jersey, Bergen, Essex, Hudson, Hunterdon, Middlesex, Monmouth, Morris, Somerset, Sussex, Union, and Warren, and in southwest Connecticut, Fairfield. Once again, this was only a test. situations, specially built receivers are automatically activated to warn of the impending hazard. Tests of the signal are normally conducted by the National Weather Service in Mount Holly, New Jersey every Wednesday between 11 a.m. and noon. If there is a threat of severe weather during the normal test time, the test will be postponed to the next good weather day. Reception of this broadcast, and especially the warning alarm tone, will vary at any given location. This variability, normally more noticeable at greater distances from the transmitter, can occur even though you are using a good quality receiver in perfect working order. The warning alarm tone will be activated for hazardous weather watches and warnings for the following counties in northern New Jersey, southeast New York State, and northeast Pennsylvania, in New Jersey, Bergen, Essex, Hunterdon, Morris, Passaic, Somerset, Sussex, Union, and Warren. In Pennsylvania, Monroe, Northampton, Pike and Wayne. And in New York, Orange, Rockland and Sullivan. This concludes the weekly test of NOAA Weather Radio All Hazards, station KZZ31 in Hamburg, New Jersey. Thank you for listening to NOAA Weather Radio All Hazards. I hope you enjoyed this demonstration. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and feel free to subscribe to my channel. Hit the bell notification to be notified of my latest videos. 
Have a good week, everyone, and God bless. Bye-bye.